In this one, we're talking about how to use Opus Clip the expert way. Let's get into it. So first of all, for those of you that don't know, Opus Clip is basically an AI tool that is used to clip down long form videos. However, there is a rookie way to use this tool and there is a professional way to use this tool. And so that's what I'm gonna be showing you in this video is how to actually use this properly. So this is basically for creators that are creating long form YouTube videos, try on hauls, vlogs, podcasts, you know, things of that nature. And so over the last few months, Opus Clip has become very, very popular for clipping down long form videos. Why? Because it is incredibly simple to use. Basically, all you have to do is take the link to one of your long form videos on YouTube. You paste it in right here. You click this button and then just like that, it's going to start spitting out a bunch of short form videos. It's going to automatically add captions. It's going to automatically choose the most you know, entertaining or the most engaging parts of your long form videos. And it's gonna start spitting out all of these short form clips that you can then post on all of your short form platforms. Now, one of the main things to keep in mind when you're reposting or repurposing content is that none of the social media platforms like duplicate content. So in other words, if you have multiple TikTok accounts, you don't want to take a single clip and post it on TikTok one, TikTok two, TikTok three, so that you have the same exact video on multiple TikTok accounts. So when you're repurposing content, you want to make sure that when you take a clip, you're posting it from platform to platform, for example, TikTok to Instagram reels, to YouTube shorts, to Snapchat, and so on. What you don't want to do is take that same exact clip and post it on TikTok one, TikTok two, TikTok three, and so on, because most of the time you're going to see more damage than good. So I'm going to go ahead and show you my Opus clip repurposing workflow, because if you come into Opus, you can see that by default, it already has these options to where you can basically send these clips uh, to some of these other platforms. But there's actually a much better way to do this. So my workflow goes something like this. Obviously, the first thing that I'm going to do is create a long form video and post that onto YouTube. Once that video is posted, I'm going to take the URL and I'm going to copy and paste that into Opus Clip. And from there, the next thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to basically just take a look at each of these clips and make sure that they are actually decent clips and I can use them on my short form platforms. Now, instead of using these options to repost onto these platforms directly from Opus, what I'm gonna do instead is I'm just gonna go ahead and download each of the videos that I plan on using. And now that I have the videos downloaded, I'm gonna come here to the Creative Center on TikTok. And so I'm just gonna go ahead and upload one of my videos right here. And now I can just, you know, make any modifications to the caption. So Opus is automatically gonna put in a caption for you, but obviously you can, you know, change that or customize it or add hashtags or do whatever you want. And then from here, I'm just going to schedule the video and choose whatever date and time that I want it to post. And then I'll just go ahead and click schedule from there. And then I'll just follow this same exact process for all the remaining videos that I downloaded from Opus. Now, in order to have these videos automatically sent to all of my other short form platforms, I'm going to use a tool called Repurpose IO. And Repurpose IO is probably one of the best repurposing tools. Also, make sure you click the link in the description below because I have a full list and a demonstration of all the different repurposing tools and AI tools and different things that I use for content and marketing. Okay, so let's say, for example, I'm sending a video video from TikTok over to Facebook Reels. Well, every single platform has its own sort of, you know, rules and customizations that you're allowed to do on their particular platform. So in the case of Facebook Reels, I don't want to just send the video from TikTok exactly how it is, because with Facebook Reels, you can have a bigger description, you can add links, you can have a call to action. So what I'm going to do is set up those particular settings inside of repurpose so that every time a video goes from TikTok over to Facebook Reels, it's going to automatically add Add a call to action It's going to automatically add a link and you know however I want to set that up and that obviously also applies to all the other platforms you want to make sure that you are customizing the settings to where it's modified to fit properly 
on the platform that it's going to. And so with repurpose, you can customize all those settings so that it's actually modified for the platform that it's gonna be sent to. So in the end, I have a system that looks something like this, where I'm going to basically just upload all of my short form videos into TikTok and schedule those to go out, you know, once a day or something like that. And every time one of those videos is posted on TikTok, it's going to automatically get sent over to Instagram Reels and Twitter and Facebook Reels and YouTube Shorts and LinkedIn and a backup copy to my Google Drive folder. So that's pretty much it for this video. Just a quick one because I've been getting some questions about Opus Clip. So that's it for now and I'll see you in the next one.